seems that the last bastion of good storytelling might come to an end. So Japan reads governance of ESC data and sectors as plant rules of that You know, Sony has gone woke. They moved to California. Okay, Square is going woke. All of these Japanese companies are starting to go woke. The big companies, of course, the indie stuff will still continue to create, provide good stories, good characters. And so I think those people are going to take over. But as these big companies continue to be compliant to ESG. So then I don't know what ESG is. It's basically, you know... They want to promote, you know, diversity. They want to promote woke ideas. Okay. And they want to promote a global system. Okay. America, you know, we all know American entertainment is pretty bad. You know, has been hit pretty bad. Okay. Fee, you know, for, for example, Disney. Look at Disney. Okay. The Walt Disney Corporation. Okay. Disney is not doing too well. And I don't think I don't think the ESG scores are gonna go over too well. Okay. Yeah. Because of how it is. Okay. Yeah. But all these companies keep trying to bow down to Twitter, keep trying to bow down to ESG. Okay. And they keep trying to bow down to all of these stupid rules. Like, why can't they just make stories that they want to make? Okay. Why can't we just have fun stories anymore? Why can't we just have, you know, comedy? They killed comedy. Okay. Why can't, you know, basically what they're doing is just bowing down to BlackRock, bowing down to all these, you know, NGOs and all these groups here. Okay. So the last principle of storytelling. Okay. Is falling to the globalists. Is falling to it. Okay. You know. That's why Japan. Japanese stuff was doing so well. Because Japan. They didn't give a crap about this stuff. Apparently. But now apparently. They are. Basically now bowing down. To ESG now. Which means the last bastion. Of good storytelling. Is over. Okay. Goodbye.